everyone, awesome guy ninety five here, and welcome, drag welcome back to Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. And now, without further ado, last time I have successfully defeated the Ginyu Force, and now, without further ado, the adventure continues, and the battle of Frieza rages on today on Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. So here we go. And while Vegeta is taking some Z's, it's time to sneak off with the Dragon Balls and make our wish. So here we go once again today on Dragon Ball Z. I don't sense Freeze's power level close by. Someone's on the move. Wait, that power. It's Dende. Krillin, go on. What are you doing here? Uh, well. We finally collected the Dragon Balls, but we can't do anything with them. So we thought we'd head to Guru's place and ask him what to do. I knew it. This is perfect. Grand Elder Guru told me to find you two and tell you how to use the Dragon Balls. You won't be able to make a wish unless you say it in the Namekian language. Namekian, huh? I guess that would explain why it didn't work before. We need to hurry. Grand Elder Guru doesn't have much time. Frieza might be on his way here as we speak. Uh, right. Oh, yeah, what about Vegeta? He said he was going to rest up, right? Yeah. He's probably still sleeping. Good. We got to make sure we're extra stealthy on the way back. Ugh, made it. So how's Vegeta? Uh... He's still sleeping. Well, he's been in his fair share of battles recently. Now's our chance to leave him here and go make our wishes. We gotta grab the Dragon Balls and make our way out of here without waking him up. Even if Shenron wakes him up, we should still have enough time if we're far enough away. All right. It looks like Vegeta doesn't even know we're here. Yeah. Someone's coming this way. They're super fast. Huh? <laughs> it's Frieza. Hurry, Dente. Do what you need to do to help us make our wishes. R right. Takarato poporunga, poporito paro. They're glowing. And the sky, it's getting dark. Just like the Dragon Balls on Earth. You who have gathered all seven Dragon Balls, now state your wishes. I shall grant you any three wishes that are within my power. Uh, whoa! That Namekian Shinron is one generous dragon! Hurry! Tell me your wishes before Vegeta or Frieza get here! Oh, uh, right. First, ask him to bring back everyone on Earth who was killed by the Saiyans. Bande Parura, Ruti Meraru, Fan Paritsu, Kumere Tohero, Runchuro, Itash Kunchpa, Pontero, Rupche! I am unable to grant that wish. I am only capable of bringing back one person at a time. It seems they can only wish back one person at a time. Hey, let me talk to Gohan. 
Hurry! Okay, okay. Place your hand on my shoulder to talk to him. Thanks. Gohan, can you hear me? It's Piccolo! Mr. Piccolo? Listen up and listen good, okay? I know what's going on there. That first wish of yours, use it to bring me back. If I'm back, then Kami will be as well. You have to trust me on this. We can use the Dragon Balls on Earth to resurrect everybody else. We can bring them back. Yeah, that's right. I totally forgot about that. And, as for the second wish, you have to make him send me to Namek. I want to make that wretched Frieza suffer slowly for slaughtering my people. I'm a lot stronger now thanks to the training I've done. I know I can beat him. You have to warp me to Namek. Okay, Mr. Piccolo. Good. Do whatever you want for the third wish. Dinde, ask him if he can bring back Piccolo. He was a Namekian that used to be on Earth. Okay, you said his name was Piccolo, right? Tetorapto Hoto Piccolo, Pupimero Papi Moposo, Patorate Morimpe, Kuri Pupas, Kuya Kirigo! Oteku Horoksa, Ferro Pupo! Understood. I will grant your first wish. <laughs> Kame! Piccolo, what is this? What in the world are you up to? For our second wish, please ask him to take Piccolo, the guy we just brought back, and then warp him straight here to Namek. Okay! Tarumopura Akororu, Stenonithuru, Hikoloru Magaka, Tamakaroru! Consider it done. I shall grant your second wish. This is a very long cut scene. <laughs> so this I tell is you. Planet Namek, the home of my people. Not sure why, but there's something familiar about it. Now's not the time to get emotional. I need to find Gohan and the others. I'm sensing a mass of energy in the distance. Oh, it must be that monster, Frieza! I sense three huge powers near there. They've got to be Gohan and the others. I thought for sure Frieza was on his way here. But what the hell is going on? Why is it dark outside? There's no night on this planet. What the hell is that monstrosity? Those Dragon Balls and those twerps, they're gone. That beast must be the Shenron creature those two were talking about. Ugh, I can't believe they took the Dragon Balls right from under my nose. Damn them! Your second wish has been granted. Now, state your final wish. Wait, he granted our wish? Then where's Piccolo? Well, you did ask to have him sent to this planet, but... but you didn't say where. D did you want me to have him sent here? Oh no, now what are we supposed to do? <gasps> dun dun dun! Go He's pissed. Oh. You actually thought you can trick me? You're going to pay for that! How could you be so stupid? Get it through your head! Frieza can't be defeated unless I'm immortal! Wait... We get three wishes! So that means... There's still one left! W what are you doing, Gohan? Well, now that's what I like to hear. Now then, make me immortal. Frieza's already on his way here. Hold on. 
Do you not have a final wish? Oh, man. We're out of options at this point. Hurry, Dinde. Grant Vegeta's wish! I hate to admit it, but he's our best shot at getting out of this mess. Okay, I'll ask Purunga. Yes! Finally! Frieza has no hope of beating me now. Even if I don't have the strength to beat him, I'll eventually wear him down. <laughs> okay, here goes! Uh-oh, that's not good. It's the Grand Elder! The, the dragon's disappeared! He's gone! The Dragon Balls, they're, they're stone! Rip. G Grand Elder Guru? He's gone. Rip Super he Comic Guru. Died. What, what do you mean? The, what about my immortality? Uh, I'm, I'm sorry. Oh. Uh, oh no. It's Frieza! Well, you've really done it now, haven't you? You have destroyed my dream of attaining true immortality in the most spectacular fashion. Dun, dun, dun. As for the lack of response from the Ginyu Force, I suppose I have you to blame. I don't fully understand what has happened, but this is a rather surprising turn of events. How could I have foreseen the Dragon Balls turning to stone just as I was about to make my wish a reality? I can only imagine Vegeta's disappointment, though it pales in comparison to my own. This is a first, to be sure. No one has ever been foolish enough to make a mockery of me on such a grand scale! You... You worms will pay for this! I'm going to make your deaths long and painful! None of you will escape my wrath! Prepare to experience hell! We're... we're doomed! What is his power level? There's no way we can beat someone like this! It's over nine? Of course. Don't forget it. Did you really think three measly ants could defeat a dinosaur? We can beat you! There's enough power between the three of us to take you down! The power level of those two keep rising, and the kid still has a ton of untapped power ready to go! Not to mention, I'm getting even closer to becoming your worst nightmare, a Super Saiyan! I grow tired of hearing about that preposterous myth. Please, you are no Super Saiyan. <laughs> it's no myth. I'm strong enough now to take on even that freakish transformation of yours. Transformation? Did you say transformations? What are you talking about, Vegeta? A small number of people throughout the universe have the ability to transform when needed. Some camouflage themselves with it, while other beings use it to conserve their energy. My transformation serves another purpose, I'm afraid. You see, my power is so great that I struggle to contain it at times. Uh, what did you just say? He's bluffing! Relax! He doesn't have that much power! Oh, you think so? You know, I recall when I took over Planet Vegito. I hadn't a need to transform in order to subdue you simian barbarians. And your king. That's right, Vegeta. Your planet was nothing special. Not even your father. I wouldn't be so cocky if I were you. My father's strength back then pales in comparison to mine now. Ah, so it was Frieza that destroyed the Saiyan planet. Go on! Transform! Show us what you really look like, Frieza! <laughs> Very well. If you wish to die that badly, then I'm more than happy to oblige. 
You're in for a rare treat! Not many have had the privilege of seeing this form! What's this? Impossible! Power level! It's insane! Nani? <laughs> Careful now. This won't be like before, and I won't be gentle. Perhaps you've noticed my massive increase in power. In terms of power level, I would say it's over one million. What? No way! <laughs> oh my, you look rather scared, Vegeta. What's wrong? You weren't expecting this? For me to be this powerful? <clears throat> Damn you, Frieza! Now then, who shall I send to hell first? What about you? <laughs> Gruen! What have you done to him? To save him, such a he'll be dead soon enough. How surprising. That little attack of yours just now actually managed to hurt. But you are no match for me. All you've succeeded in doing is angering me further. Oh, it's no use. Damn it. So much for that plan of ours. The energy from before is larger now. Frieza appears to have finally made his move. <gasps> There's an energy nearby. <laughs> it's now like must be Namekian. So you're the Namekian the Earthlings were talking about. They got their wish. <laughs> Good for them. You seem to know a lot about what's going on. You probably also know these Earthlings called me here to help them, not to talk to the locals. Sorry, but you're on your own. I don't know what kind of training you put yourself through, but your power, it's unbelievable. <clears throat> Too bad it's not enough. You... you might have actually been able to take on Frieza if you recombined with your other half. What? You mean I could stand a chance against Frieza if I fuse back together with Kami? Is that what you're telling me? That's right. I was no match for Frieza. But I... I got a sense of his power. There's no way in hell I'd join back with that dried-up dolt. Besides, I couldn't even if I wanted to. <laughs> 
then, then fuse with me. If you do, you'll increase your power tenfold, maybe more. What? Fuse with you? There's not much time. I only have a few moments left. Your mind will still be your own. Quickly, place your hand on my body. <sighs> Fine. I'll do it. <clears throat> Make Frieza suffer for what he did to our people. Oh, I'm planning on it. <clears throat> <clears throat> This is amazing! I feel incredible! This... this is unreal. This power... it's unbelievably incredible! So... so this is what he was talking about! I'm on my way, Gohan. You can win! You feel great! You can do this! <laughs> Team 4 Star reference. I can't help myself. I can win with this kind of power. Nothing can stand in my way now. I have just obtained the ultimate power! You've toughened up quite a bit. Thanks to you, Mr. Pit. You know, liars have a special place. A, a guardian never lies. Kami, I am at your every beck and call. I am humbled by your generosity, Mr. Popo. All right, now that that's out of the way, it's time to energy. defeat Frieza. Or if Piccolo can, anything's possible. He can Give win. He can. He feel great. He can do this. <laughs> okay, let's go. What's wrong, Vegeta? Are you not going to save him? <laughs> him? But he... What? <laughs> How is that pathetic worm still alive? My attack should have been fatal! You won't be able to cheat death again once I've torn you into a million little pieces! Solar Flare! <laughs> My eyes! Now, Vegeta, attack him with all you got! Why didn't he use his Kienzon? <laughs> AKA his destructive disc. Seriously, that would have done a lot that would have done a lot of damage. Seriously. Use your Kienzon next time! Thank goodness you're still alive! Here, let me heal you! <gasps> he, he had that kind of ability? What are you doing, Vegeta? Why the hell didn't you tell me that Namekian Runt had the ability to heal people? Because we didn't know either. 
If we had known, we would have had him heal Goku! You really surprised me there, Dende! Thanks! Good luck! His power has increased rather significantly. I suppose it's because he has the blood of a Saiyan. It might not be much, but it should be enough to tip the scales in our favor. Impossible! That little cretin was on the verge of death, I'm sure of it! <laughs> Something's coming! M Mr. Piccolo! Sorry to keep you waiting. Of all the people to show up, it had to be the freak we killed back on Earth! The Dragon Balls were used to bring back this dead weight? What a waste! Vegeta's a racist. Sorry to disappoint you, but let's make one thing clear. I'm coming after you next. Once I take care of Frieza, that is. So another Namekian worm has come to die. Back off. I fight alone. What? What? <laughs> it's your funeral. You have no idea what you're up against, but fine. Go ahead. <laughs> There's something different about this one. No matter, it's of little consequence. He's still far from a worthy opponent. No way! He's actually fighting on par with Frieza! No, he's doing better than that! Wow, I knew Mr. Piglo could do it! <laughs> I must apologize for my attitude before. I've underestimated you, but I'm afraid you're still out of your league. Allow me to demonstrate my true power! Well then, guess I'll do the same. <laughs> it appears you don't fully grasp the danger you're in. Did you think what I've shown you was the full extent of my power? What? You simpleton. You're clearly unaware that I've undergone a transformation. Prepare yourself. You're about to experience dread like you've never felt before! Transformation? Now, that I have your attention, it's only fitting 
that I instill you with hopelessness as well. With each and every transformation, my power increases quite considerably. And still, I have two more forms beyond this one. You know what that means, don't you? You, you can't be serious. Uh, no. He, he's got two more forms? Prepare yourselves. You have the esteemed privilege of being the first to see my next form. Rejoice! Mr. Piccolo, I'm gonna fight too! You kidding me? No! You're wasting your time! I need you to beat me within an inch of my life! Huh? <sighs> he looks like a dinosaur. <laughs> Ew. I apologize for the wait. Shall we begin round two? Ugh, you monster! Now, let's see, shall we? He's recovering from Mr. Piccolo's attacks! Damn it! I have you now! <laughs> All right, it's about time we witness the time to witness Frieza's final form. This isn't even my final form. Let's go. Maybe you now realize just how powerful we Saiyans can become when pushed to our limits. What are you waiting for? I can't get a power boost if I harm myself. I need you to do it! With that little Namekian's healing ability, I can recover from whatever you do almost immediately! I'd love to beat the snot out of you, believe me, but I can't. I mean, Goku's gonna be back any minute now. Kakarot isn't going to get stronger, he's a loser! Now, while I could snuff the life out of you in my current form with the most minimal of efforts, I wonder, yes. I think I'll demonstrate to you just how truly terrifying my power is before I end your pitiful lives! <laughs> Now's our chance! Hurry up and do it! <laughs> <laughs> You have to get out of here! Oh, right! Uh, uh, what did you say? What in the hell do you mean you can't heal me? Y you killed so many of my people. I, I can't heal someone like you. Uh, why, you insignificant little... I need to help the others! Are you okay? <sighs> Thanks a lot, kid. Krillin, why did you attack Vegeta? Don't you remember? Saiyans get stronger every time they survive a fight to the death. That's why Vegeta asked me to attack him. Oh, yeah, that's right. Dende, 
Look, I get it. I know why you don't want to heal Vegeta, but we're screwed if he can't fight. But... <laughs> Just heal him. I'm not strong enough to take Frieza on my own. <sighs> What's going on? Is that Frieza? His transformation's complete. Dende, please! We need you to heal Vegeta! <sighs> <sighs> Took you long enough. <laughs> Frieza should be no match for me now. Finally, feast your eyes on a Super Saiyan. He's coming into view. Behold, Frieza's final form is here. That's Frieza's true form? It's so small and compact, but it's intense. Guess it's true what they say. You can't judge a book by its cover. Still, I think I liked his other forms better. Sorry I couldn't help you guys out. I know you all went through a lot of trouble trying to wish me here. Dende! You know, I couldn't help but notice that little Namekian had the ability to heal you. Poor little green. Rip. I'm afraid I can't have any more of that. <laughs> well then, let's begin, shall we? I made you a promise, didn't I? I said you would experience a dread like no other you felt before. Ugh, his speed is incredible! So that's Frieza's true form. But I won't lose. Not as I am now! The question is... Is Vegeta really a Super Saiyan? Find out right about now! Here we go! It seems your moves were too fast for the runs to catch, but I can see them clear as day. I admire your confidence, Vegeta, but I'm afraid your mind is so overcome with fear that you've become delusional. You won't be laughing for very long, Frieza. After all, you're up against your greatest fear, a Super Saiyan! Frieza's final form. <laughs> you haven't lost your ridiculous sense of humor. There won't be a need for Kakarot when I'm done! I can see you! Prepare yourself! <laughs> Prepare yourself! Answer... no. Not a Super Saiyan. Impossible! Th this can't be happening! I am a Super Saiyan! Go to hell, Frieza!
I don't believe it. This can't be. Absurd. This can't be the extent of my power. Are you finished? I think I'll make the next move. I'll be gentle. For the very first time in his life, Vegeta had finally begun to experience true dread. Overcome with hopelessness and frustration, he was reduced to tears. The mighty prince of the warrior race had lost his will to fight. If you wish to save him, feel free to try at any time. Kidney punch, kidney punch, kidney punch, kidney punch, and pause! Kidney punch. I can't help myself, but it's hard to watch. I'm overflowing with power. It's actually kind of freaking me out. Whoa, I better get going. Hang on, guys, I'm on my way. It's Goku's turn to save the day again. Here we go, but first, I gotta save my progress, update my status, blah, 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 and here we go. My name is Goku. I'm insane from Earth. <laughs> I love that part. Uh, from Team Four Star. I love it. Enjoy. Here we go. Hmm. Sorry I'm late. I'll take things from here. Dad? Uh, Goku? It looks like I still have some trash to dispose of. K Kakarot. <laughs> hmm. Kakarot. Oh, I see. So you're a Saiyan as well. I intend to rid the universe of every last one of you. <laughs> Different about Kakarot. Has he finally done it? <laughs> Is he a Super Saiyan? <laughs> you actually countered one of my attacks. I'm impressed. <laughs> hmm? Frieza, I'd get serious if I were you. You're finally face to face with your worst nightmare. Uh, a Super Saiyan! <laughs> the, the legendary Saiyan warrior, the strongest fighter in the universe. <laughs> Your finish, Frieza. <laughs> You're finally going to get what you.
Did I not make myself clear before? I've grown tired of your pathetic jokes. Stop! Don't you see he can't fight back anymore? He's done. Just let him go. Kakarot, you're just as soft as always. Perhaps you're not a Super Saiyan after all. <laughs> you idiot. Stop letting your emotions hold you back. Stop being so soft and you can finally do it. You can become a Super Saiyan. Kakarot, listen. Our home planet, planet Vegeta, wasn't destroyed by a meteor. It, it was Frieza. We, we Saiyans, we Saiyans were his enforcers. We followed his every order. Mm. Your parents, my father, the king, they, they were all murdered by that monster. <laughs> I beg you, Kakarot. Please, please, defeat Frieza. Please, I beg of you. He must die by saying hands. Rip to the Saiyan Prince, Vegeta. I was wondering when he'd finally die. Vegeta. It must have been really difficult for a proud guy like you to beg me for help. I hated you at first, but I began to understand over time you were a proud Saiyan warrior. Just know this, I'll do what I can to carry on that pride of yours. Hey, I'm a Saiyan raised on Earth. And to avenge those you've brutally murdered, the Saiyans and the Namekians, I'm going to defeat you! Utter nonsense. We're just in the way. We need to get out of here. Go on. Come on, hurry! Please don't die, Dad! Make Frieza pay for what he did!
This has been fun. It's been quite some time since I've exerted myself this much. Man, I'm in trouble. If he's serious about the half power thing, then even the Kaioken times ten isn't gonna be enough. I should be able to hold my own if I push it to times twenty, though. My body might not be able to handle it, but I've gotta try! Now that was a lot of damage. Unfortunately, it won't be enough. However, there is only one way, Goku's only option, and this is it. What's going on? It, it barely, it barely did a thing. My dad's energy, it's a lot weaker than it was before. I can't believe someone's actually that strong. Guess King Kai was right. Can't believe I'm saying this, but we shouldn't have picked this fight with Frieza. Cuz you saying? <sighs> well, now that actually hurt. That actually hurt. Where has all your energy gone? What? Have you exhausted yourself already? I, I can't watch anymore. I'm gonna help him. Wait. Seems like Goku's got something in the works. Goku, the legendary Super Saiyan. The Spirit Bomb! All things living on Namek, and all planets that can hear me, lend me as much energy as you can! Give me the strength I need! What are you doing? Don't tell me. Is this another one of your pathetic attacks? What can you possibly accomplish by just standing there? Uh, well, he's made a spirit bomb that huge? Frieza doesn't appear to know what's going on right now. I don't understand why Goku doesn't just attack him. He's probably thinking that he needs more energy so that he can take Frieza down for good this time. Man, I wish this thing didn't take so long to get ready. I have to make sure he doesn't figure out what I'm doing. Come on! This is getting ridiculous. How much longer do you intend to keep that up? <laughs> Not sure. As long as I have to, I guess. <laughs> Say, uh, you're not in a hurry, are you? You dare mock me? I do not understand you, Saiyans. Your kind has been a thorn in my side for as long as I can remember. Once I've destroyed that Saiyan child and this entire planet, the Saiyans will finally be no more. The legend of the Super Saiyan will remain just that, a legend.
that's not the sun. What the? Oh, we saw it. Stay here. No matter what happens, do not leave this spot. What is that? Is that some sort of ball of energy? You! It's no use. If I launch the spirit bomb at him right now, he's just gonna dodge it. Besides, it doesn't even have enough power to take Frieza down. Ah, damn it! You were planning a sneak attack this whole time. How pathetic! But all of your idiotic planning and effort has gone to waste. You're finished! <laughs> Piccolo! Hurry up and finish that spirit bomb already! Thanks, Piccolo. You vile, insignificant pests! How dare you interfere in this? <laughs> so there are more of you, are there? <laughs> you certainly know how to test my limited patience. It ends now! I will reduce you and this entire planet to nothing but ashes! <laughs> All right. It's done! Release it! No! I, I will! Not be defeated! Bombs away! <laughs> ah, nice. Krillin! Hey, you made it. Where are my dad and Piccolo? Th they were right by the impact, weren't they? You... you don't think that... Hey, it's Goku and Piccolo we're talking about. They wouldn't go down that easy. Krillin, the energy's faint, but I feel it. Right, come on, let's go! Okay. Dad! Goku! <gasps> you did it! <laughs> Let's go home, you guys. Uh, what is it, Krillin? We totally forgot about Bulma! Don't scare me like that. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. No, it can't be. It's Frieza! Mr. <laughs> Piccolo! You worms. I'm going to eradicate every last one of you! Krillin! No! Let him go, Frieza! Go, go! <laughs> and now for the little brat.
Behold the legendary Super Saiyan. You can destroy entire planets, but you can't take down one single person? What are you? You mean you haven't figured it out yet? I'm the Saiyan who's come all the way from Earth to defeat you. I am the warrior you've heard of in legends. I am pure of heart and awakened by fury. That's what I am. I am the Super Saiyan, Son Goku! <laughs> I stand corrected. I suppose the legends were true after all. I hate you! I hate you! It's over, Frieza. Is it now? I won't let it end this way. I would rather take my own life than be killed by scum like you! Fine by me. But the one that's going to die isn't me. It'll be you! <laughs> I can he wouldn't dare. In of space. Let's find out if the same can be said for Saiyans! No way! This planet will die! Don't you no! dare. Dag nabbit, Frieza. I must have restrained myself too much. But the core has been completely destroyed. In five minutes' time, this planet will explode and become nothing more than debris floating through space. Five minutes, huh? Well, that's all the time I need. I'll avenge Krillin by defeating you, then find my friends and get out of here. Defeat me? Impossible! You have given me no choice. It's time to show you. Prepare for my full power! Frieza, you know, the only reason I'm letting you reach full power is because I want to beat you at your best. As a warrior, I wouldn't have it any other way. 
the fact, you want to test out your full power too, don't you? Goku, what are you saying? You couldn't beat Frieza then. My oh, forget for the it. Wait. As requested, this is my full power. Goku struggling. At this rate, he might not be able to make it off planet Namek before it explodes. No way. There must be something we can do. Wait, that's it? Yes, that should work! Guardian of Earth, Kami, can you hear me? Yes, King Kai, I can hear you. Will you be able to summon Shenron right away? I have a wish to make. Ah, oh, yes. I've already had Mr. Popo gather all of the Dragon Balls. We were planning to use them to revive those currently in your care. Right. Because Earth Dragon Balls can revive many people at once. But can they revive those who died naturally? I'm afraid those who died of natural causes cannot be brought back. But what about those whose lives were shortened as a result of an encounter with a villain? Hmm. I suppose such people could be revived, if only for the brief time that was taken from them. All right, then. Here's the wish. Ask Shenron to bring back all those that were killed by Frieza and his men. What? I'll explain. We don't have much time, so I'll make this quick. First, we'll use the Earth Dragon Balls to revive all those killed by Frieza. That should mean all the Mechians, including Grand Elder Guru, should be revived. We've only had two of the three wishes granted with the Namekian Dragon Balls. How very strange. With Grand Elder Guru back, we should still be able to make one last wish, right? With that last wish, we'll transport everyone on Namek other than Frieza to Earth. Oh, I get it! You've really thought this through, King Kai. Anyway, that's the gist of it. Now hurry! Planet Namek won't be around much longer! Oh, oh I see. I'll summon Shenron right away. Now, state your wish. I shall grant you any wish that you desire. What is this place? Have I returned to the world of the living? Grand Elder Guru of Planet Namek. This is King Kai of the North Quadrant of the Galaxy. Please listen closely. Oh no, global warming? No! <laughs> I can't with that part from Team Four Star. I'm going to blow you to a million pieces, just like that Earthling! What are you talking about? 
Are you talking about Krillin? Don't you dare talk about Krillin! All right, the final Pick battle begins. Here we go. To explode. After this cutscene. There should be one wish left with the Dragon Balls there. I need you to summon Shenron. For the last wish, ask him to send everyone there except Frieza to Earth. I understand, King Kai. I appreciate your concern, but wishes must be made directly, I'm afraid. I will contact whomever is closest to the Dragon Balls and tell them your wish. Wait! Don't make that wish! Listen to me. Ask him to leave both Frieza and me behind. Come on, ask him! You heard us, Goku? I, I understand what you're trying to do, but... Listen, King Kai. If you don't let me finish things with Frieza, I'm never going to forgive you! Fine, fine. I understand. If that's really what you want... Then there, my child, this is Guru. Grand Elder Guru? Please save your questions. I would like you to ask Purunga to grant one final wish. Then there, will you ask him to transport all those on Namek except for Frieza and the Saiyan Goku to Earth? Okay. Is something wrong? Do you not have a wish? Here... Here is our final wish! What? That's... The... The Dragon Balls! No, wait! Hoporunga, Frieza, Pipoto, Goku! Make me... Immortal! No! Poporunga, Frieza, Pipoto, Goku! Poparito, Romrompa, Papipo, Paro! Understood. It will be done. However, all except these two will be sent to Earth. Peace out, Frieza. My children, this huh? is a planet called Earth. My time is once again at hand, I'm afraid. But before I leave this world once more, I wish to explain what has just happened. The battle against that fiend Frieza still continues back on our home planet. Meanwhile, back on the dying Namek. <laughs> Would you look at that? You need to speak the local language in order to make a wish. 
It's just us now, Frieza. Me and you. Finally, I've been waiting for this. How very curious. It would seem you're willing to pay the ultimate price to settle our conflict. Very well. The final confrontation begins. My power. It's my turn now. It's my turn now. When I kill you, the destruction of this planet does no this. One thing is certain. You will die! Probably. It's my turn now! It's my turn now! You cannot hope to defeat me! It's over, Owarida. Oh, I'm done. You're done? This fight is over. There's no point anymore. I can tell you're afraid. I don't need to defeat you anymore. You, you dare mock me? I will not lose! You brought this upon yourself, Frieza. Though I have to admit, I didn't see it ending quite like this. Cuz you saying? Uh... I'm going to make my way back to Earth. You can stay here and suffer the same fate as this planet. I beg you. P please have mercy. Please have mercy. I beg you. How can you beg for mercy? How many people begged you for mercy uh, before you slaughtered them? How many? Uh, 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 I beg you. I've given you just a little bit of my energy. 
That's all you get. You're on your own. <laughs> You're the greatest being in the universe. And that is why you, you must, you must die by my hand! You fool! What? That's a lot of damage! Indeed! Epic cutscenes. I love it. It is done. What a grand episode this was. This episode was the longest I had to do. Hurry, Goku! Hurry! Andale! Goku survived his battle with Frieza. However, planet Nemec had finally reached its limit, exploding in spectacular fashion and leaving Goku nowhere to be found. Back on Earth, Vegeta and the relocated Namekians resolved to stay with Bulma for the time being. Not much time had passed before Grand Elder Guru once again passed away. This time, surrounded by his people. With Mori as the new Grand Elder, the Namekian Dragon Balls would be ready in one Namekian year, or 130 days on Earth. Though the Namekian Dragon Balls were only capable of reviving one person per wish, they could revive those that had died multiple times. Upon making their wishes to bring Goku and Krillin back, everyone received some shocking news. Goku was alive, and he was on his way back to Earth. To prevent Krillin from being brought back to life on the now destroyed Namek, his soul was brought back to Earth with the first wish, and then revived with the second. No longer needing to revive Goku, next in line to be brought back was Yamcha, whom everyone was more than happy to see. Then, another 130 days had passed and two of the three wishes had been used to bring back the beloved Chaozu and Tien. Then, with the third and final wish, the Namekians were transported to a new planet. Along with their legendary Dragon Balls. And that's the end of the Freezer Saga. What's that now? You're telling me Frieza's alive? And right now he's making his way to Earth with his father? They're probably gonna do something awful while I'm not there, aren't they? You're not gonna get away with this, Frieza. Huh? Who are you? Stay tuned for the next episode of Dragon Ball Z! The fight for the future against the Android Terror! You don't want to miss it! And that will be next time. This episode has been the longest out of all my episodes in this series. And I've completed the Freezer Saga in this one single episode. Ah, before I do anything else, I'm going to save my progress. Save my progress, save my progress into one file, and then. I'll be done. So with that in mind, thanks for watching. Be sure to leave a like and a comment down below and tell what you think. I'm awesome guy. 95. Oh wait, hold on. Gohan.
How are your studies going? Uh, okay, I guess. You lost a lot of ground during your little excursion to Namek. We've got to get you caught up. Yeah, but I've been studying so much. I don't think I can cram anything else in. Oh, all right then. Fine. You can run outside for a breather, but make sure you don't take too long. Got it? <laughs> Thanks, Mom. I'll be back soon. Yes, soon. Understand? Hey! Hi! <laughs> no? Okay. <laughs> Later. Huh? Hi there. Boma, hi. hi. <laughs> Thank you so much. Time to see what I can do. Anyway, thanks for watching. Be sure to leave a like and a comment down below and tell me what you think. I'm awesome guy 95. Stay tuned for more Dragon Ball Z Kakarot next time. And with that in mind, I'll see you next time. In the meantime, stay safe, take care, tip waitresses, and saving my progress. And peace! See you next time. Bye!